This is one of the best cookie recipes I've had in a very long time. Chocolate cookies stuffed with Nutella. Hello everyone. First thing you're going to do is prepare the Nutella for filling. And what we're going to do is place one heaping teaspoonfuls of Nutella on a cookie sheet that's been covered with a silicone mat or waxed paper. And you're going to do this until you get 30 little dollops of Nutella. Then you're going to put that in the freezer and you're going to freeze it for about an hour until they're solid. And now for the cookie dough. In a large bowl, place two cups of all-purpose flour, three quarters of a cup of cocoa powder, a teaspoon of baking powder, half a teaspoon of baking soda, and a half teaspoon of salt. And don't throw it into the bowl like I did. Probably just gently pour it in. Stir the dry ingredients around until you don't see any lumps of cocoa in the mixture. Now for the wet ingredients, that is one cup of butter softened and three quarters of a cup of granulated sugar. We're gonna to add to that three quarters of a cup of packed brown sugar. And you're going to mix those things together and cream them until it is light and fluffy. Now add two large eggs, one at a time, and two teaspoons of a vanilla extract. You're going to stir all of these things together until you have a nice smooth consistency. Then you're going to gradually add in the dry ingredients a little bit at a time. And don't forget to scrape down the sides of the bowl at least a couple of times during the mixing. Once the dry ingredients are all mixed in, you'll have a fairly stiff cookie dough. Once it's done, you're going to stir in one cup of chocolate chips. The recipe calls for milk chocolate chips, but I used semi-sweet chocolate chips. Stir those in with a spoon and then cover your cookie dough with some plastic wrap or with a lid and put it in the refrigerator and chill it for a couple of hours. Once your cookie dough is chilled, you're gonna take out scoops of it or dollops of it and press the cookie dough into a disc shape and take one of those little frozen Nutella dollops, put it in the center and then cover it with dough. I kind of rolled it between my hands and I just went all around to make sure that it was sealed completely. I suggest you only take out maybe three or four of those little Nutella dollops at a time out of the freezer because they melt fairly quickly and it gets really messy. So continue to make your cookies. You're going to make approximately 30 of these cookies. If you have any leftover Nutella, just throw it back in the jar. Put them on a cookie sheet. They spread a little bit, so make sure you leave a couple of inches in between each cookie. And you're going to bake them at 350 degrees for about... 10 to 12 minutes until the bottoms are lightly brown. Here's one out of the oven. And the bottom looks a little dark, but it's actually not burnt, just a little light brown. It's hard to tell with chocolate cookies sometimes. And I just want to show you the outside. You can see the chocolate chips showing through. And when you break it open, you have a wonderful little melted Nutella center. And none of my cookies leaked. All the cookies, the Nutella stayed in the center and didn't come out, so they worked out really great. I absolutely love these cookies. So did my son Max, and I brought a few of them to work, and everyone enjoyed them. Uh, they taste a little like brownies. It's a very nice chocolatey flavor, and you, nothing beats having that Nutella center in there. They're great. I love this freezing technique for centers, and I might try it with other things like peanut butter, so there you go, Nutella stuffed chocolate chip cookies, give them a try. I have many, many cookie videos and I've put them all together in a playlist. So if you wanna spend many hours watching me make cookies, go ahead and click on the screen or see the link in the about section below. Thanks for watching.